What's up YouTubers? Welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone's doing well, staying safe out there and washing your hands, most importantly now. So for today's video, we'll be looking at quote unquote playing the changes, but more importantly how if you have these two chords, how one note can really decide which chord you're on. So if you're interested, keep watching. Let's jump in the video. So like mentioned before, today we're looking over playing the changes using major pentatonic. And in this case, we'll be referencing China Cat by the Grateful Dead. <laughs> Right? In this jam, it's G Mixolydian. And the solo, it goes from G Mixolydian to D Mixolydian. And transitioning between those two is actually quite simple. So first things first, let's look at the scales. G Mixolydian, if you were to watch my previous video, is a major scale, but with a flat seven. Right? And then we take it up here. So that's G Mixolydian. Now D Mixolydian, again, a D major scale, but with a flat seven. Pretty simple. Now between those two scales, there's only one note difference and that is the F sharp, which in G would be the major seven, and in D is the major third. So when we're soloing up here, and we gotta transition now to that D, we can just go one half step lower to that F sharp, and that'll indicate that we're in this D, and you can solo using D Mixolydian. So now let's take all that and build a solo using the G major pentatonic and D as well. Let's go. So now, learning what we just did in the previous clip, Let's build a solo using that G Mixolydian and D Mixolydian and transitioning from G to D by just changing one note, that G to the F sharp. Awesome. Now let's zoom in on the camera and see what's actually happening. So the first lick is pure G major, even as this cool little triad, and then goes down chromatically to that F, which would be the flat seven and make it that mixed Lydian sound. So here's the first lick. So you're spelling out that G triad, right? Mm -hmm. 
So after you go to that flat seven, you're gonna go up the scale command when you start from that G. G, A, B, half bend to that C, back to that B. So together. Slower. Now pure major. Let's move the camera here so we see how with the fretboard. So we're right now doing this. G, right? Let me zoom in a little closer here so you can see that a little better. Right? Now we just spell that again, another G chord. So all together so far we have. And that F sharp is signifying now we're in D, right? Turn from here. We're going down the scale. And now we're in D. So that whole G section together slowly is. One more time. Now we're in G mix Lydian. Remember, the only notes that are different between those two scales are that F, which would be the flat seven in G mix Lydian and F sharp, which would be the major third in D, right? So now we're in D. Strictly D mixed Lydian, a D major scale, but with a flat seven. So let's check out those legs. So we transition from here to D. We're gonna spell out a D chord. Right? We're just going up strictly the D mixed Lydian scale. time. Right? Ending on that 
C, which is the flat seven, making that Mixolydian sound. Back to the top. And now we can go down. And you can really do whatever you want at that point. Just make sure you're hitting that C. And you're staying here in this C, in this D position, sorry. So all together, G and the D part we have. Right? One more time slower. So yeah, those are the licks, right? That's a perfect solo for China Cat in the first section, G to D. Remember, G makes Lydian, a major scale, but with a flat seven. Same with D makes Lydian, a D major scale, but with a flat seven. The only notes that are different between those two is that F sharp. F sharp being the third in the key of D, while well, it would be it would be the major seventh in G, but since we're doing G makes Lydian, it's F. So I hope you enjoyed the video. That's the lesson. All right, guys, that's today's video. Hope you had fun. I know I did. China Cat is one of my favorite Grateful Dead songs and so much fun to jam over. So I hope you enjoyed the video. And again, I wanna state the point that playing over the changes can't be so difficult and it can be as easy as just changing one note. For example, in this case was changing that G to an F sharp to show us that we're now on the D chord and jamming in D mixed Lydian. So I would say learn your scales, learn what notes are in those scales, learn the modes, what changes them to become the mode. Like for example, a mixed Lydian scale is a major scale but with the flat seven, right? At which point you can see these two different scales and say, oh man, between these two, there's only one note difference. So yeah, hope you enjoyed the video guys. If you did, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.